think about it and come up with a strategy. It says here the compound beam is pin supported at B. So at B, it is pin supported. Pin supported, so you've got two reaction forces. And supported by rocker at A. At rocker at A, which means it can move in this direction, it can be lifted, but it cannot move downward. So therefore, there's one reaction force here. <coughs> and it's hinge pin at D. Hinge pin at D. So it's pin, you got two reaction forces there. At C, that's also a rocker, so you got a reaction force here. Determine the reactions at the support. So we are after A Y, C Y, B X, and B Y. Come on, gentlemen. You've got five minutes to solve this. <clears throat>
Anyone got the answer? Um, not all of them. Like I'm still working on A, Y, and B, Y. You will not be able to get the answer, I guess, if you look at the whole structure. Think about it. Yep. And then also think maybe you need to draw the feedback diagram of DC member only. Think. You may need to start your analysis by drawing DC. But look at the whole system. Anyone got the answer? Yes, sir. Um, sir, is BY coming out to be 23.46 kilonewtons? Yep. Hmm. I got the same, like dy is 4.55 kilonewton, cy is 1.52, bx is 3.5, um, ay is 3.09 kilonewton, and by is 23.46 kilonewton.